Hello guys, in this video we will be discussing about the continuous probability distribution some problems based on it okay so here it is given that find the value of k such that f of x is this thing so how to how to identify whether it is a continuous probability distribution or not from this only we can identify this c 0 to 3 the value is given okay function values given but elsewhere that means minus infinity to 0 correct to 0 and 3 to okay z equal to so minus infinity to minus 1 and 4 to infinity the value will be 0 that means the value still infinity it is there so it is not discrete we don't know it is not finite correct that's the point here so when our function is distributed like this in certain intervals so we can say that it is continuous probability distribution and it is also given f of x is pdf what is pdf pdf means probability density function probability density function since it is a probability density function we have to find the value of k we can apply that see if suppose any function is given as a pdf so we can apply minus infinity to infinity of f of x dx will be equal to what one it's same same like what we have done in random variable this thing discrete probability functions there we did summation of p of x equal to one the same logic here whenever it is given that is it is pdf that means minus infinity to infinity f of x dx will be equal to what one here minus infinity to infinity the intervals are given as 0 to 3 so i'll replace it with what 0 to 3 because or else where it is 0 so no need to write if you want you can write okay what is f of x here 3 by x by 3 plus k d of dx correct now that implies we have to just integrate this is integration okay so x by 3 so i can replace it with what it's not x oh it's x by 6 okay x by 6 so i can replace so i can write what is x by 6 uh, integration it becomes x square by 2 right so 2 into 6 is 12 x square by 12 plus k integration will be what k is constant therefore i can write k into 1 so one integration is x from where to where I have to indicate 0 to 3 0 to 3 I have to integrate which is equal to what 1 correct now the thing is so upper limit minus lower limit upper limit is 3 lower limit the both the terms become 0 because when you put x equal to 0 this term is 0 x equal to 0 this term also is 0 so you have to just apply upper limit so what is upper limit here so 3 square by 12 plus k into 3 equal to 1 okay correct so i will get it as what 3 square what is 3 square here 9 9 by 12 so it's that implies 9 by 12 plus 3k is equal to 1 that implies 3 3 is a 3 4 is a that you shift there so it becomes 3k is equal to 1 minus 3 by 4 4 minus 3 is 1 1 by 4 so that implies 3k is equal to 1 by 4 that implies k is equal to 1 by 12 so we got the value of k now now what else we have to do the next thing here it is we got the value of k now we have to find one more thing probability of x 1 to 2 so interval it is also an interval so probability of 1 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 2 which is equal to same thing integration minus infinity to infinity this only this only part you have to apply 
so minus infinity to infinity f of x dx but here the interval is 1 to 2 f of x dx and which is equal to what what is f of x here see interval 1 to 2 which is in this interval itself okay 0 to 3 so you can see over here so in between 0 to t 3 only 1 and 2 are lying so we can directly write that 1 to 2 f of x will be this term x by 6 plus k dx which is equal to you have to differentiate but here what becomes here k k becomes what 1 by 12 which we have found out so it becomes integration of 1 to 2 x by 6 plus k is 1 by 12 okay dx so integrate you will get x square by 12 plus 1 by 12 x so i can replace with x correct because 1 by 12 is constant constant into 1 i will do so it becomes integration of 1 is x so x by 12 and x integration is x square by 2 so x square by 6 into 2 is 12 limit 1 to 2 so upper limit minus lower limit you have to do so it becomes 2 square by 12 plus 2 by 12 minus lower limit 1 square by 12 plus 1 by 12 so when you do all this and add and subtract you will get the answer as 1 by 3 okay so this will be my answer